a little bump day, but also like quick bikini haul, I guess. This Moana bikini, someone had told me that they sold really sexy ones. This is a 2XL. And like, it is pretty sexy, but I think I have it on backwards because I think the big part is covering my, you know what? Because <laughs> the back part is like super, super cheeky. Like, can you see? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Not getting out too much here, but yeah, this is actually super cute. And I feel like it's really accentuating this bump, although the bump could be getting bigger because I am 29 weeks pregnant, which is like so crazy. A little baby in there. Um, but I thought this was like a really cute bikini and I wanted to just try it on for you guys. Cause I really didn't think this was going to fit. I saw it and I was like, no. And what's really cute. It's actually reversible. There's like little toucans on the inside, but yeah, if you're looking for like sexy, like pregnant, <laughs> this is pretty good because like I said, I'm about 245 or three. So normally I would probably want to get like a three X. It only goes up to two X, but it's really like forgiving, but I think it has nice support for the milkies you know what I mean <laughs> um but really really cute um y'all packed my uh hospital bag already <laughs> I packed my hospital bag just in case for everything um finally booked parenting classes CPR classes so doing those next week but I was like oh my gosh baby girl is gonna be here in like 11 weeks it's crazy and I always think like oh my god I'm not ready I'm not ready but we're like fully ready as can be but then I was, I was thinking, like, can you ever fully be, like, ready, ready? You know what I mean? Um, but, yeah, appetite has been growing. So has the the belly. Um, she is moving so much in there, which I just, like, love to feel. I have yet to, like, capture it on a video. I keep, like, filming it, like, because every time I feel a jolt. But I can't, like, see it yet. Oh, man, the minute I can like show you guys, you know I will, but like we definitely can feel it. If you guys could just put your hand right here, you'd be able to feel her. Um, and it's pretty cool. I do think she can recognize voices. Like I think she recognizes her dad's voice versus my voice. And I feel like her movements are a lot different. I feel like when her dad puts her hands there, she's very much like, cause they have like touch now. They like have, they develop touch. When her dad puts her hand there, I feel like she's more like daddy let me cuddle with you and then I feel when I have my hands there I feel like she thinks we're playing because she's kind of like rolling around and like having me find her um and so I think that's kind of fun too um so she's been really good I've been loving the kicks again I am 29 weeks so maybe they get more intense as we get closer but I have been loving the pool for exercise has been great can I show you the pool the reason I'm not filming towards the pool is because we have a giant tarp the bees have finally gone away let me show you guys this bee saga right there it is. It's very not attractive, but, um, basically I'm trying to put you over there. Basically we put the tarp there because the bees were landing in our little, like we had like a little waterfall trickle down when the heater was on. Cause we like heater pool. And even when it wasn't heating, there was just like this little, like it was basically like a little ledge for them to like get water where they wouldn't drown. Like if they go in our pool, they basically drown. So it's one, too hot to land on the tarp right now, but two, like they wouldn't be able to go get the water. I guess there's like one over there, but they're going into the buckets. So that is the bee update because basically we had bee specialists. We had bee specialists come out and basically like they couldn't find the hive. Like the hive was probably like in our neighbor's yard or something like that. They couldn't find the hive. Um, so we paid $150 to basically have two people tell us they can't do anything. They're basically like, yeah, they're just going to like be there forever. And I was like, okay, that's cool and all. But like when we have like our daughter and stuff, we can't have her being like stung by the bees or by dogs. So we're going to put the buckets. They're going in the buckets. Now we're going to be putting the buckets up. Basically the buckets just have pool water with some salt in it. And hopefully they'll just go find that water because they just want water, which, you know, we're happy to oblige, but also like not in that area. Um, <laughs> one other question is the shaving. <laughs> the shaving shaving has become so much more difficult you guys like I used to be able to like lift up my belly if I needed to but this part does not go anywhere and I can't see so at this point it's a guessing game when I'm down there it's just going from memory I'm like okay okay and I do kind of do it like this kind of out and it's like okay let's guess let's guess let's guess that's kind of where we're at now with the shaving game <laughs> legs too it's kind of harder luckily I have a little stool in my thing so I can put it up but yeah sometimes I just have to sit down on the floor as if I was in a bathtub and shave but how did you guys do it honestly like I said I'm a little past seven months and I'm just like what's it gonna be like at nine months at you know what I mean like am I gonna have to have my husband shave me I don't know that's just that's a whole other issue but 
we're getting there because <laughs> I still want to feel like sexy. You know what I mean? And I feel sexy in shape. These crows though, are you kidding me? Um, but yeah, other than that, there's not much else difference. We have our doctor's appointments this week. So more ultrasounds will be going. If you guys like the ultrasounds, they're on my vlog channel, but I did just want to pop in here really quick and show off this weekend because I just thought it looked really cute. I don't know. My belly's looking, my bump is looking cute. Yeah. She's so quiet now though. I'm like, oh, I wish she'd be active. Sleep. Rest well, baby girl. And yeah, I just did a video Q and A. So guys, check that out if it's not up already, but I hope you guys have a really great holiday weekend. I feel like it's a holiday weekend, but are we really celebrating being Americans this year? I hate to say it because I do love our country. Our country is just being really embarrassing right now. It's kind of just like that boyfriend that you want to mature, but he just doesn't. And you're like, I love you. Why are you acting like this? I want to be together. Like, I want to be in this with you, but you're literally embarrassing me and giving me no other choice but to like disown you. That's kind of how I feel about 4th of July this year, which sucks because I always like celebrating 4th of July, but I guess we take it as a day off. I don't know. Guys, what are we going to do about this America situation for real? I'm not sure, but that is the updates. But yeah, hospital bag is being packed because like I said, I just feel like there's so many stories of like, obviously I don't like, I'm not like anticipating it, but there's so many stories of like when you're induced and all this and like early delivery and stuff. I still have a couple months, so baby girl going to keep cooking in there. <laughs> and, um, yeah, just getting everything around, just all the basics. If you guys want to see nursery and all that stuff like that, that stuff is coming. Um, we just kind of make everything like perfect. And then we'll show you, we could probably show you progress, like steps along the way. Cause like my husband's been filming it all, but yeah. Anyways, I guess that's the update. I've been feeling really good. Thank you guys all for asking. It's really been just such a blessing to have such an easy pregnancy. Um, it's been really great. So oh, there's so much movement over there. <laughs> all right. Well, anyways, this is very cheeky. So I am going to just kind of lay by the pool until, um, until we're going to cook dinner easy life so anyways thanks guys for watching that's my little bump date for this week next week will be 30 weeks ah, i don't know how this happened i don't know how it happened so quickly but it's happening <laughs>